Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Alex here, and today I wanna to talk to you guys about a setting that really every Samsung owner should enable. It is absolutely vital that you enable this because it will allow you to find your phone if it ever goes missing. You'll be able to track the location of your phone, and in the worst case scenario, if your phone becomes unretrievable because it was stolen and you just can't find it, you can wipe all the data off of your phone so you don't have to worry about somebody breaking into your phone and having access to all of your personal pictures and data. So to access the setting, what you wanna do is go to your phone settings, scroll down to security and privacy, and in here you'll see an option that says find my mobile. Go ahead and tap into here and then tap allow this phone to be found. Now you will need to have a Samsung account in order to do that. So if you don't have a Samsung account, you really should sign up for one because having a Samsung account allows you to have access to a lot of extra features that are only available to people who have a Samsung account and Find My Mobile is one of them. Now, once you do have this enabled, you can see that there's a few different options right here. We have Remote Unlock, which will allow your phone to be unlocked remotely. Now, I don't really think this is a feature that you probably would want to use. I don't think you want to unlock your phone remotely. If somebody has your phone or it's lost, you probably maybe don't want to unlock it. So I would just leave this one disabled as is, but then this one that says Send Last Location, you definitely want to enable this so that your phone can share its last location if you're ever trying to track it. And then you have this Offline Finding feature right here, which is really cool cool because what it will do is use the Samsung network to locate your device. So you can see it says this will allow your phone to be found by other people's Galaxy devices even when it's not connected to a network. So this is actually really cool because if somebody steals your phone or you lose it and it gets shut down or somebody puts it into airplane mode and it's not connected to a network, it can still be located if there are other people with Galaxy devices nearby. All right, so there you go, guys. Once you've set that up, you're pretty much good to go. There's nothing else you need to do. Your phone can now be located and controlled remotely if you ever misplace it or lose it. And in order to track it or manage it remotely, all you need to do is go to this URL right here from another phone or a computer and log into this Samsung account that you created and it will track all of your Samsung devices. So I'm gonna do this on a computer and show you what that looks like. All right guys, so here we are on the SmartThings Find website. So what we're gonna do now is just sign into our Samsung account. And once you do that, it'll bring us into our SmartThings Find portal. And in here on the left, you can see we have all of our Samsung devices. I only have my S23. Uh, ultra right now but if you have earbuds smartwatch or any other phones they'll all populate in here and then in the middle you will see a big map now i've blurred this for obvious reasons i don't want to dox myself but you will see the location of your device on the map and then we have this little menu up here at the top right and this is where the power of everything lies you can completely manage your phone remotely from here so if you're nearby your phone but you can't see it you can always ring it so maybe it's in the grass somewhere or under your couch cushions it it will let out a ring and you'll be able to hear it and find it that way. You can also lock your phone. You can retrieve any inbound or outbound calls or messages that came or went from your phone. And there's also this feature here to extend the battery life of your phone. So you can see up here, we can see the health of uh, the battery health of our phone. And if we are out in the park or somewhere looking for our phone and our battery is running really low, we want to be able to ring our phone. But if our phone runs out of battery, it's gonna be really hard to find it. So we can actually hit extend the battery life and that will put our phone into low power power mode and hopefully have our battery last long enough until we're able to locate our phone. Up here you can also hit this little arrow to update your phone's location so if your phone is stolen and somebody is moving around it will keep checking your phone's location and hopefully help you track it a little bit better. But most importantly in here if worst comes to worst and your phone is unretrievable you know you lost it and there's no way for you to get it back what you can do is erase all data so that anybody who has your phone will not have access to any of your personal data. Now before you do this, there's a great option here that will allow you to back up your phone. This is amazing that you can do this because if you've given up on finding your phone, you can at least restore all of your information and all of your data on your phone. Just hit this backup button and it will give you an option of what you want to back up. You can quickly take a backup of your phone. It will back it up to your Samsung cloud. And then once you've got everything backed up, you can go ahead and erase all of the data on your phone. It will ask you for a verification code. And once you verify, it will completely erase your phone and kill all the data, all your pictures and everything on your phone so that at least whoever has your phone will not have all of your private data. So as you can see guys, this is a really amazing and powerful tool that Samsung provides for us. And I highly suggest if you guys don't have a Samsung account or you're not tracking your phone, if you don't have this set up, definitely create a Samsung account so you can at least rely on this feature to be able to track 
track your phone and hopefully find it. But worst comes to worst, you can at least back up all your data and erase everything from your phone and keep all of your data secure and to yourself. All right guys, now there's one more thing that I'm gonna get you to do. If you go to your phone settings and then scroll down to lock screen and then tap on the edit button here on your lock screen, you can see that down here, there's a section here for contact information. So what you wanna do is tap into here and add an alternative phone number or email address so that it will show up on the lock screen so that hopefully if anybody finds your phone and they're a kind soul, they will be nice enough to be able to reach out to you and return the phone to you. So just add your email into here tap done and then you go to your lock screen you can see your email will show up right there so again hopefully if somebody finds your phone they're nice enough to reach out to you and return the device back to you but there you go guys that's going to do it for this video i hope you learned something and i hope i convinced you to enable that find my network it's definitely a very important feature and it will just give you some peace of mind knowing that you can at least delete all of your personal data from your phone in case it gets stolen or lost but that's going to do it for this video. If you enjoyed, be sure to leave a like, subscribe for future videos to come, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.